Okay, everybody, and welcome back to my Let's Play. Alright, so... I'm going to... Uh... Hold on. Sorry about that. So, anyway, uh, I pretty much had some mess-ups during my last broadcast, and that wasn't fun. Um, I got kind of kicked off the internet, and I couldn't really get back on, so... But it's working again, so I'm back on. Alright. And now I'm going to head on to, uh, right now I'm located, I was just doing these little tiny missions right up in here, and I did it, so I kind of took care of this little town full of ghosts and whatever, and all the ghosts are happy now, so everyone's good. And now I'm going to work my way down over here, and it looks like there's like a really cool little, uh, one of the undaunted the first Undaunted quest starts over here, which is funny because you get that quest at the beginning back at Devon's Watch in the tavern. So um, there seems to be like a little town or something kind of like interesting down over here. So I'm going to go check it out. Um, but I've pretty much explored most of this entire area. It's Ebenhart. Ebenhart. And, you know, I don't know if I've made it. You know, I, I might have made it over here, actually. Yeah, I must have. And then all around here, so... I've explored quite a bit. I could probably, it looks like there's something over here. So I should go and do some exploration, but there's just, there's just so much to explore. And um, this is just most of like Morrowind, just a small section of Morrowind right here. And then uh, there's a little section here. You can't go over here, which is really sad. But um, down here is Deshaun and I just started to get over there, and you, as you can see, it's just about as big as this location up here. And it took me days and hours just to kind of get through most of this, but, um, and you guys have been following me with that. So, okay, anyway, uh, enough map questing, whatever you call it, <laughs> map adventuring. We want to continue on with my little story. Alright, so, this isn't going to be... You know what? I should probably try to find a way down, downstairs. Yeah, down the. Let's get out of this. Let's follow along the main road. This is my problem. I don't follow main roads. I like to go and search through a bunch of stuff <laughs> on side roads and through the forests. You know, I'm probably going to have to go around the village. Because I'm guessing if I tried to jump down there, I would die. Oh, wait. I, can, I think I can do it. Woohoo! And we're off, bitch. We're off. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You see a way shrine. Go, go. <laughs> oh, there we go. Plantation discovered. Oh, here we go. We got some new missions popping up now. Hello there. Uh, Hello. Stars above. Finally, someone with a bit of sense to them. Uh, please, traveler, help out a fair trader, hi? What happened? Bloody Argonians, that's what happened. <laughs> a gang of mad lizards hissing and spitting their crazy chants. My God. They stole every flask of my stock and fled up to the cave on the hill. Uh. I'm a brave mer. I'll walk the Ashlands. But I'm not suicidal. <laughs> well, this guy is racist. You are racist. Racist cop. Anyway. How can I help? How do you think? I'm a respected trader with the Dark Vale Trading Costa. One of the largest importers and exporters in the Southern Isles. Get those potions back, and I'll make it worth your while. Alright, I'll get your potions back. Don't worry about me. I'll be waiting here with these rented guar, my carts, and the stench of decomposing guards. <laughs> no rush. What the... Well, what is this Dark Vale trading coaster? One of the largest merchant concerns in the Ordinary Dominion. The Costa runs trade out of the Isle of Oridor. 
I was sent here by my masters to secure a compact with the Dark Elven House Dreads. Things have not gone according to plan. That's because you're a douche. Anyway, where are you headed? The city of Kragenmoor. The head of House Dreads sent the master traders of Skywatch a missive indicating his interest in commerce. And thus, ever the faithful servant. I That's am here. I'm going the way the same I'm going to the same place. So can you tell me more about the attack? I'm not sure what to tell you. When the beast struck our little convoy, I hid beneath the cart. Then they came out once they'd gone. Coward. I hired these guards to keep me safe, but well, I find myself wishing I'd contracted a higher class of cell sword. A higher class. So uh Hmm, I think I've asked all my questions. Well, goodbye. You suck. <laughs> There's so many racist elves. I think I'm the one elf that isn't racist. That's a hot dark elf. Kinda wish I made my skin a little bluer. Oh well. There's no going back now. Alright, uh, so... Ooh. I'll take those. Lovely little, little drinks there. Lovely little drinks. Oh. You stay with those decomposing... people. That's a person, just standing there. Alright, so, well, speaking of drinks... I shall probably have some of that. I needed to get off my horsey to... There we go. Oh. <laughs> this too. Just a bunch of stuff, please. Just a bunch of stuff. It's good to get half the stuff out of your inventory anyway. It starts taking up everything. You know what? I'll get this. I'll eat the stale bread. You know that's amazing. Increase max health by 726 for 35 minutes. Give me that. <laughs> People just walk by and see me drinking and eating. All right. Now that I've stuffed my face, I'm full. <laughs> Go, Yoshi. What is that? He's a narrow. Plantation. Oh, I have a feeling this might not be so good. Oh yeah, see, look at this. This is the cute little Khajiits. <laughs> They're cute. I do not fear you. What the? All right, now I fear you. I don't like zombies. Go away, go away. <laughs> Pitiful fool. I feel for you. Not really. <laughs> oh. What the hell? I don't want it to automatically take things. You. Say something. Speak now before I hack you apart. Ugh. Uh, what's going on? Good. It's not inside you. Now, listen. What? There's some horror making copies of people. When it kills you, it twins you. It makes a copy of your body for its own. However, it's not a perfect copy. It can't mimic speech. Is that why you killed your troops? I had to kill them. They were changing. Do you think I'm mad? See for yourself. I was in the cellar of that stable when it copied one of my troops. I locked it down there. Here's the key. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Kane, this entire place so far is just covered in zombies. I mean, it's just zombie land. And when you get to Dijon, it's just like there is another plague 
turning people into weird zombies. It's just, I don't get what it is about the zombies, but so far I've been encountering quite a bit of them. All right, so I'll take a look for myself. Go on, enter, enter the stable the cellar. cellar. Make, Make friends with that, whatever it is. Why? Why do I have to do these things? Did you burn these bodies? I did. Look, I don't know how this thing works. All I know is it climbs inside people. Oh. It kills them and then creates a double. When you kill the double, it sheds the body and runs. If it needs a new place to hide, these burnt corpses won't be it. Oh my god. Some other form of creature. Well, this reminds me of um, the little uh, face huggers from Aliens. I mean, it would be kind of cool, though, if people were turning into those, because I like aliens. But I don't understand. Oh, rune. Must collect the runes. That's right. All right, so it looks like I have to go kill some zombie things. Leave it up to me to kill all these creatures. Look so bad so far. Hey, what the? Alright, for some reason though, things are getting a little, uh. Let's go to my options. I don't want to be able to grab things right directly from barrels and stuff, because I, I don't always want it, but I want to be able to check. Auto loot off. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Default soul gem. Interesting. All right, we're good. Bye bye. There we go. Now it won't just grab everything. That's better. Going into the creepy basement. Oh, great. Why? What the fuck? Oh, hello. It seems there's a creature over there. First I will steal from this body. This corpse has stretched, bruised flesh. Ah, oh, its clothes were soaked with blood. Judging from the exit wound in the soldier's back, something tore its way out of her from within. Well, that's not good. I don't like this place. I'm leaving. Bye. <laughs> Why is my voice shut on? It's just me. I will take these healthy drinks that I will hopefully not be infested with plague or creature. All right, bitch. It's time for you to die. If you don't like it, do you? Then, then so bad. Why is she not dying? You know what? My staff stuck. I'm gonna switch to double blading. Best what? We best weapon so far has been my siphoning. She is a level 13. Die. Oh, shh. Wizard battles. Completed? That's it? Chase the creature? What creature? Uh. I'm not chasing no creature, okay. Oof. Who wants that? All right, so what's these cute little drinks right here? Ooh, honey berry tea. Empty bottle. Well, I'm done. This place is scary. <laughs> Go back to the barn, the creepy barn. Oh, um, I see we have company. Doop -doo. 
Oh, here, another player. It's growling at me. Call off your creatures. Have you seen my husband? We got separated when those Khajiiti animals started rioting. Why is everyone hating on the Khajiit? No, I haven't seen him. This is all their fault. The hauntings of the destroyed crops, the ruin of a beautiful home, their foul-smelling animals. <laughs> I told Tyrell that the catmen make poor slaves, and then there's that monster. They brought it here. What? What do you know about the monster? Rashad has summoned it. He's some kind of shaman. My husband broke up a ritual that Catman was performing a few nights ago. Catman. <laughs> we punished everyone there and confiscated a totem from their makeshift altar. The creature's afraid of that totem. What do you mean? I saw the creature slip into one of our guards. He attacked me, so I panicked and hit him with the totem. He wailed and ran off. I should have kept that totem with me. In all the chaos, I left it in our bedroom. Well, I guess I'll have to get that. Foolish girl. Oh shit. They're like necromancers. Where'd it go? This is like a giant pumpkin patch. Oh my god. Oh, I thought all of these pumpkins I could take. Oh my god, leave me alone. Can you see I am pumpkin patching? <laughs> I am pumpkin patching. Patching pumpkins. Smashing pumpkins. Let's go this way. <laughs> Why is this place invested with pumpkins? Shadow things think they're funny. Oh. Now you die. Ooh. That's right. It's two different locations here. Why do I keep running into these creepy towns? Oh god. You see a dead corpse outside of a house. It can't be good. It's not very welcoming. Oh, it's quite lovely. I was expecting a shack. He glares at you. <laughs> hmm. Well, I'm just coming in. Say hello. Must be upstairs. What's in here? Yay, lore, lore books. There's nothing in the night shelves. Ooh, I'll take that. Idol of the Hollow Moon. It's like a creepy skull. What is this? Just an empty bottle. No one needs it. No one cares. All right, let's go. Hmm. Oh dear. Should. Uh Oh. Ah, uh, Bravel. Searching all things, bookshelves. This is good. This is good. I wonder what could be downstairs though. Let's double check. 
This looks like a creepy summoning room. I'll take that. Hmm. Cardlock picks. I actually need to buy more of those. Right, we're going upstairs. I've had enough of this place. Oh, hello, Lorraine. Welcome to my gaming evening. <laughs> There's something wrong with the team. I'm, I'm afraid to go near him. That's not Tyrell. I found his corpse in your bedroom. No, I don't believe you. I know that's him. There's just something wrong with him. Nope, I'll prove it to you with this idol. Use the idol on Tyrell's double. Do I have to? Do I really, really have to? So where's his... This isn't going to be pretty. Oh. What the? Excuse me. Great. What the hell? Oh, I don't remember this being here. Oh, great. Let's get it on with you die. Or not worth it. <laughs> nice trick, but I'm over here. Uh oh. Lucky I ran out of siphoning power. Chasing of the spirit creature is annoying. <laughs> Nothing interesting in there. You don't want to go in. It's not worth it. Oh, what the? Who are you? I heard Rivali screaming. She said you chased it down here. I took a swing at it, but it got away. Is Rivali safe? She's upstairs crying over her husband's corpse. Go on up there. If her husband starts to move, kill him with fire. Oh god. This is just unpleasant. Why did I come to this city? I should have left. I should have just walked right by it. Who are you? Oh, you're an NPC. <laughs> you're not an NPC. Oh, she's upstairs. She's upstairs. We were going to expand the plantation. We wanted to trade the useless cat men for some strong Bretons and red guys. Oh, these guys are horrible. You know, you deserve everything that's coming to you. That's probably why they did it, because you're a bunch of slave owners. Do you want this idol? I want nothing that belonged to that dirty cat man, Rashada. He brought that monster here. He must know a way to send it back. Nope, nope. You've had it coming. Complete the quest and give me my money. The barn in the center of the plantation. Maybe he stayed to watch his monster tear us apart. Wicked animal. Here, take the eye. I don't want it near me. Stay here. I'll talk to the little Kajit. The little. Like he's my cat. Where did this guy come from? All right. This is a lovely bed. Spoiled rotten. You don't need slaves. Do your own work. <laughs> I think I'm good here. I can leave this creepy house. Okay, so... 
talk to Ashada. And then... What's this? Oh. This dead Khajiit clutches a message. Read the message. Hmm. Once you've started the fires by the house, meet the... Unjasi and free the prisoners. He'll be waiting south of the barn. Tonight we will find freedom. Aha! See, they don't want to be slaves. I should investigate the building south of the barn. This is just... This would be a lovely place. It's too bad it's infested with creepy things. If you're wise, you will die quickly. Ectoplasm. This woman's body has a crumpled note beneath it. After the prisoners are free, bring them to the quarters east of the barn. We've hidden weapons there. Arm them and prepare to fight. I wonder what these Khajiit have. It's all Khajiit that are dead in here. But I thought the Khajiit were helping themselves. This is a mystery to be solved. <laughs> hey, Noah. <laughs> Greetings. Quarters. I know it says I'm not supposed to really go in here, but looks like fun to explore. Ooh. I will take all that you have to give. Ooh, bread. Oh my god, that cheese looks so good. I could eat that right now. I love how you just find random food that god knows how long it's been standing out. Oh my god, pies. A Breville Millet Muffin. Delicious. Nope, don't want it. Don't want that. I want a muffin. Damn, this game makes you fat. Makes me want to eat. This is such a pretty little village. It almost, almost reminds me of like... Ooh, ooh, sky shard. Oh. All the powers are mine. Oh. I should kill you. You're going to die. You know what? I don't need your ectoplasm. I'll search this though. I've searched that one. I'll go in here. Hello, anyone home? Or was I just in here? I think this was the same one I just was in. No, I don't think so. We'll go in here. Hello? No one here. Hmm. Everyone take heart. Kotesh will set fires and Rashada will summon spirits to create chaos. Unjasi will bring the prisoners here. Meet Jaker in the pumpkin patch by the stables until then. Be brave and think of home. Hmm. A slave scroll. Poor Khajiit. Coffee. I'll do it out. Bread, yes. Cheese. I think we should eat some, actually. That is amazing. God, yes. Pumpkin puree. I love how I just eat pumpkin puree right out of a, like, a 
bowl. Cheesecake. Oh my, God, six sixty for thirty-five minutes. Ch carrot cheesecake sounds delish. This is a muffin. Delish. All right, bye. I'm out of here. Let's go speak to that. Oh shit. Well, I was going to let you live. Not do this side. Ah. Oh, my brains. <laughs> I'll take that. You bring Rashada the idol of the hollow moon, yes? Yes. Moons guide you, stranger. Is it true you summon that monster? Yes. Rashada's beautiful wife is most precious, Jazadi. The lashes stripped her fur to the bone. She died from their torture. That is why this one called the Dromatra. Rashada regrets this. Trading hate only brings more suffering. What's a Doom Brumatra? If Rashada had many knights, he could explain. We integrate Tamriel's gods with our own so we can blend in. We also do this to amuse ourselves. But there are Kajiti spirits outside Tamriel's pantheon. Dark spirits, eh, hey, a Tromathra. Um, Tromathra. Uh, how do we stop this one? Use the idol on the dark spirits, then kill them to charge it. While you hold the idol, anything that possesses you will cease to be. This is how we stop the monster. This one must apologize to Rivali. Meet us in her home when the idol is charged. Very well, goodbye. And okay, I put the soup on. Lovely as always. Surrounded by zombies right now. If you want, can you just check the soup, Kayla, and make sure that it's not boiling down for me? I want to stir it a little. Is there plenty of liquid in it? It's still good. Okay, good. I'm making a tomato broth soup stew sort of thing. Time to kill all the little things. We were the only group that solved the puzzle. Really? Yeah, and the other groups had like 10 people in it, and we had three. Wow. Do you know why? We play video games. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because you're uh, three geeks three versus gamers. like 10 normal people. Yeah. <laughs> it was awesome. Like, we took a, like two minutes extra, though. But they let us keep playing because they're like, we're so close. And you guys had it on easy, right? Yeah. It was hard. It was not, it was not exactly easy. Alright, so anyway, this Khajiit is carrying a map and a sealed message addressed to Vahara. And an area north of the plantation is circled on the map. I should find this location. Yay. First piece, chapsticks. Oh my god. That's for you. Thank you. You're welcome. I need it. I come back with gifts. She comes back bearing gifts for me. As I play. So I'm off to. I, what the? You know what? I am not helping anyone. I'm just going to run. <laughs> oh shit. Hey, that was pretty good. Oh, what a lovely place. Oh god, it's really sunny over here compared to the other place I was in. Here we go. Please show mercy to Vahara. She wields no weapons, nor does she harbor ill thoughts against you. Jaka led the revolt here. Did you know him? Yes. We grew up together in Sensha. Jaka looked after Vahara. He fought the slavers to protect her. They put Vahara in the mines, and Jaka down here. Word came to Vahara that Chakur would start a riot. He did it to be with Vahara again. This is for you. This? No. This isn't happening. And I get a mace for this with 76 bucks. Okay. So that's it? That's the whole... 
Oh wait, I gotta use the idol. Just when I thought it was safe. I hope so. So where am I supposed to find these creatures? Great. Other NP I mean other players are here to kill the things when I need to kill them. One down, four more to go. Right there. Oh, really? Oh shit. Everyone settle down. I need to cast spells on you. Oh, yeah, right, I'm gonna die. Easy. No. Thank God. No. Oh, shit. I kind of needed him. Good thing I had that pie. Going backwards, gotta go back. Not easy. Uh, I don't know. Hold on. I got to do this. I have to finish this madness. Oh, why did I take the ectoplasm? block when I do this. That person's dead. One more. It looks like you want to die. Thank god. It's a bloody mission. <laughs> Hopefully I can sell this ectoplasm. Because I really don't want it. Hmm. Back in this creepy house. Actually, it's kind of cozy. Hear the crunchy sounds and it's annoying. Quiet girl. <laughs> Rashada asked to be forgiven. The beast blathered about understanding and change. The animal responsible for the death of my Tyrion dared to address me. He spoke of peace. He spoke of his dead wife and his tortured people. He's mimicking sorrow. Kajita are incapable of normal emotions. Oh. <laughs> Look at my sweet Tyrion. Rashada must pay for Tyrion's death. You agree with me, right? 
I know Rashada generally mourns his wife. You believe that? But my team. Enough. Enough, Dad. Where is Rashada now? The cat went to the stables. Tell Ulof to meet us there. Rashada wanted you to use the totem on some godless altar east of the pumpkin patch. Once you found Ulof and used the totem, meet us at the stables. Did he say why I must use the altar? He said the ritual would protect you. If you kill the creature while holding the charged totem, it will be destroyed when it tries to possess you. I don't know whether to believe him or not. Hmm. This is just madness. Into the fire I jump. <laughs> I saw Khajiit run out the door. What's going on? That's Rashada. He has a plan to slay the monster. Go to the stables and wait for him. I'm taking orders from a milk-drinking pup and a cat. Yes. <laughs> this should be amusing. I'll be there. Good boy. <laughs> I'm a dark elf. I don't drink milk. I drink soy milk. <laughs> Oh, looks like you're all in trouble. This ought to be interesting. You better not have turned me into a vampire or something. I, this better not be a trick. Touch a shrine within three days and you'll be fine. No, that's the other games. This is the online version. And it would tell you that Actually, you, you, get, a, you get an achievement for turning into a vampire and turning into a werewolf. So you have three days. <laughs> but I wouldn't want to be a fucking vampire. Please or a werewolf. Set me free. Hmm. Why? Are there slaves here? You... Why should I care about his wife's death? Look at him! He's an animal! He's the enemy! My dear... He took my... Where is you, love? I didn't see him when I arrived. <laughs> Interrupt her. But he must have been here. Rashada was already bound. Ulla must have... Wait! Oh, it's him. It's Olaf. You are the one. What the hell? Are you going to free me? Well, I would, but that was back in the day where you could actually free the slaves. <laughs> In Morrowind, I could free you, but for some reason, there's no option to free you. You are going to die. Never trust a Nord. <laughs> Shit. Good, I have some help from the outside world. <laughs> Hmm, that'll teach you. Untrustworthy Nords. Because <laughs> I'm a dark elf. Yeah, everyone's like racist against each other in this game. I know. I'm <laughs> racist against the Nords. Actually, I love, um... The Nords are racist against the dark elves, too. Yeah, they are, it's funny. The dark elves are My hands are betraying me. I can't I believe I listened to you. Did you kill that monster? You love is dead. <laughs> But I won't forgive that Khajiit for Tyrion's death, even if he does forgive me for the death of his wife. But I suppose there's been enough killing. I have a cow. Very well. I will take your money and that helmet. In fact, your house also. I will also take your house. And your wallet. And, and your horse. Your, and your slaves. And your dog. <laughs> and this bag of corn. You know, I haven't gone up here. I should do that. Anything good that I can steal? 
Anything good up here? What? You hear that? <laughs> Fools, all of you. Well, that was a fun... Oh shit, I'm out of here. I really need to find out where to go. So... Why is it telling me to go that way? Now it seems you all want to die, but I'm falling. I'm leaving. I never liked this place. I go where it's sunny. We're good. Back to this guy. Now I have to go up here and retrieve potions. Yummy millet muffin. <laughs> what is this jelly? Oh. I should eat something with health. Bread. Now this guy is missing his potions. Hello, Unclaringer. Unclaringer. And I would believe that's how you say it. <laughs> She's like, no, you're totally wrong. <laughs> Are you still in the Shivering Isles? No. Because you're in the Shivora. I was only in the Shivering Isles for like a split second. It was kind of like a imagined up version of it. That was a while ago. This is interesting. Very different. Dragon heads. This is a, like I love that each place is really, really unique. Like you would think that it would be just copied, but so far I've gone in all these different places and um, cheese and sausage, milk and honey, and baby's breath. That's how you make butter. Knotted sheep guts all filled up with blood. Lashing. Excuse me, I'm reading a recipe. <laughs> Food. So is mine. Well then, that was very, very pleasant. Rude, though. Quite rude. Interrupted my play. My reading session. That's what they interrupted. Someone here. I'm going to interrupt. In return. You don't like it, do you? When you're reading. That's right. Very good. What's in this? Shh. Quiet, fools. I better get out of here. That doesn't sound good. Wind and sand. There is just some... Oh. I will help you. There we go. What's up here? It's cozy. Just 
What? Oh shit. I didn't mean it. What is that? Oh dear. Shit. Assassin beetle. Who did that? Who threw that? <laughs> Follow them. Oh. No. Where are you? You killed person that I was going to have I was going to heal that person <laughs> oh shit why one thing I don't like is giant bugs even though I am a dark elf and I've come from Morrowind what the oh oh Putrid. Simply putrid. I don't even think I'm going in the right way. I will take this useless item. Very nice. Anything good here? Ooh, petty soul gem. <laughs> mm. Is it petty soul? Yes. Filled with petty souls. Or there are people I know who are filled. Oh my god, <laughs> coins. <laughs> there are people I know that are filled with petty soul filled gems. Petty soul. <laughs> Petty soul gems. If this was Skyrim, it would be like a grand soul gem, but filled with petty soul. I just heard something I don't think I should have heard. Let's go this way. So, there's some potions I'm supposed to be retrieving, but, um... I don't know where they are exactly. Unless I already just did that, I don't know. Very nice, my siphoning has increased. Yeah. 
Ooh, lovely. Yes. I love when I level up things and I don't even have to use those things. Just reading the books helps you level up. There's his potions. Ooh, drinks. Take. person's helping me. It's very nice. Very nice of you. <laughs> You're very kind. Help me. Oh. It's like adorable. <laughs> don't kill it. It's just living here. I don't even think I can kill it. Oh yes, I can. It's just trying to live. Oh, it's so cute. Piece. It lives a sad life, stuck in some rat hole. <laughs> it is a rat hole. He's in luck because he's a rat. Throw a grenade and they just explode. <laughs> Great. Oh, grenade skill. Like an explosion skill. I want that skill. Go all Call of Duty out on these characters. <laughs> Are there any barrels full of oil? I just read that one. I just want to get out of this place. <laughs> I just want to get out of this place. Ugh, it's oozing out its own spittle. Ugh. Why am I stuck in a bug infested hole? At least they give you things, like, for some reason they're carrying shields and stuff. <laughs> it's like you kill a bug and it drops a whole loaf of bread. The love of the gods. The love of the three die. Vivek is not pleased. What is this? A lesser soul gem. That's good for me. And then we'll take all these magical potions. Oh god, look at this. No, no, they put a, a dragon skull. Or whatever. <laughs> like it's like a crocodile human? Yeah, a crocodile human thing. Somebody might have even done that, like, in the game. Another player. Like... Where is the way out? Where is the way out of this pitiful? Done. I'm leaving this hole. Filthy mongrels. Years, I'm free! <laughs> now, to finish this mission, give that fool back his potions. I will be known as the hero of all this land. And the drunkard. <laughs> Meaty matey infusion. 
That's what that potion's called. Ah, you're back. Do you have my goods? I've got your goods. Here you go. By the hoary host Forty gold. Thank you. If I'd arrived in front of more empty-handed, <laughs> forty. I don't think it would have gone well. He's a broke wood elf. What do you expect? With the thanks of this humble trader and his masters in the dark veil trading costs. Ew. Cheapskate. I did all of that. I got lost in some cavern, eaten by beetles. Khajiit, you deserve to die. And I also should raid your little, you know what? You live a sad life. I will take pity upon you. And now I will get to the next town. I am the hero of this land. The lover. Mm. I'm so close to my destination. I went all the way from here to down here, completing all these little tiny nickety dookety missions. And now I will finally get down there. Let's go on our little journey. Yeah. Someone killed one of those cute creatures. How dare they kill my, the creatures of my land. It's a harvest. <laughs> this is the, my land, though. I'm a dark elf. This is where I'm from. This is my land. My people. What is going on here? It seems there is drama going on. This is a bad time for Kloggenmore, Traveler. Are you here on business? Yes. If not, you best be moving along. I need to speak with your Grand Master. Oh, don't we all? I wish you luck, stranger. But you probably won't find much here. Grand Master Omin has been transformed from a bloodthirsty Nyxhound into a simpering war. What? Maybe one of the guardsmen here can tell you more. I want no part of it. He was, he was turned into a guar, the thing I'm riding. Oh! You don't know the creatures of this land. Then you are not a true Morrowind. You are not a true Ashlander. <laughs> this is a damn disaster. Oh, here comes someone running. Is it for me? No? Oh, very well. <laughs> Usually you see someone running up to you. You think it's like going to be a messenger of some sort. So I'm like, yes, yes, here I am. The hero that you've been waiting for. And then it's just some guy playing the in the world. Of watch and the Virak <laughs> Siegebreaker. Thank the Vec you're here. Kragenmore has been taken. I am that savior. Yes, <laughs> it's me. <laughs> What's wrong, guardsman? Tarnvil Indoril entered town at the head of his personal vanguard and demanded an audience with the Grand Master. Now the vanguard patrols the streets. They command in Kragenmore. What did Tanvil Indoril do? I don't know. <laughs> but when he came out from talking to our Grand Master, he was in charge. Our house elves and slaves alike are terrified. If you want to help, please speak with our Grandmaster. Maybe he'll listen to a new voice. I'll speak to your Grandmaster. Please speak to the Grandmaster. He's sure to listen to the hero of Fort Virak. Yes, that is me. <laughs> Why did, uh, oh wait, we already asked that question. Sorry, a little bit of Alzheimer's kicking in. It's this dust, you know. <laughs> Very well. I shall go to this town. You'd better have a good marketplace. Greetings. Greetings, fellow dark elves. That's right, it does. Hello, friends. Courage has fled. What do you mean your courage has fled? Foolish girl. Does this town have a market or perhaps a pub? Stay alert. We're at war, you know. We're not at war. It's all in your head. Woman, you left your door open. God knows what beetles could fly in. 
This is a lovely little piece of town. Hello. First town I've seen for a while without zombies. Slave quarters. Hmm. They must. Hey. I sharpen my claws against the stones. It feels good. She looks like she's on some kind of skooma. Mm-hmm. Lots of moon sugar. By the end of each day, Juldar is exhausted. I love when they speak in third person. <laughs> My brewing skills are unmatched for one who must work with dregs. We'll have to see about that now, won't we? Give me a black coffee. I can't cook anything because I have no ingredients. <laughs> The dust makes cleaning impossible, so why try too hard, yes? The Russian. Russian Khajiit. What is she making? Never enough provisions, but we do what we can. Can you tell me about the provisions? Of course! We provisioners practice the arts of cooking and brewing. Good food requires the best ingredients. We gather fresh meat and produce from crates, barrels, and the like. If we're lucky, we'll also find recipes in chests, trunks, and desks. Mm hmm. Then what? Once you've copied the recipe down and acquired the necessary ingredients, that's where the real fun begins. Cooking pots and rotisseries can be found all over. You need only find one. Select a recipe and then indulge in the simple joy of cooking. I see. What do you have for store here? What's this? Breville melon salad. That sounds terrible. Roast corn. Radishes and rice. Steamed radishes? Oh, no. No, no, no. Stir-fried garlic beef. Hmm. Grape preserves. I'll get that. Now, Belmora cabbage biscuits, I question. <laughs> cabbage biscuits? Ugh. This tastes foul. <laughs> it this is, is one peasant like area. I'm not pleased by the sights and sounds, the including smell. the smells. This must be the slave area. Where's the city? This is the marketplace. Pitiful. Shameful. No, I'm not doing that. When this watch is over, it's the corner club for me. The corner club. The corner club. Where is the corner club? Everyone talks about it, but I don't know where it is. Ah, now this is more fit for a, a dark Stay elf. Moist. Stay, moist. stay moist. I'll stay moist. That doesn't sound right. Stay moist. Now this is more fit for a dark they elf. Look at how lovely. Hello. Hello. All right, Grandmaster. Who are you? What gives you the? Oh, the hero of Fort Virak. That's me. Honor to you and your house. <laughs> Greetings, Grandmaster. What brings a war hero of the Ebonheart Pack to distant Kragamor? I would be more welcoming, but today important matters distract me. There's an urgent matter we must discuss. 
Apologies, but the Vanguard demands my attention at the moment. If you have further questions, and I'm sure you do, speak to my Seneschal. <laughs> Lorraine just pointed out, stay moist. <laughs> His hair is great. I know, he's fabulous looking. Beautiful hair. Thank you, Grandmaster. But I do say, stay moist. Mmm, <laughs> it's too bad I'm vegetarian because that looks good. I like your armor. Alright, so, um, that's. Let's do a little reading, a little light reading. Heavy armor forging. It's something I have to learn. Quickly, friend. Over here. What the? Hello there. Who, me? Oh, you hear that? <laughs> it's like a brothel. Caution, stranger. Speak quietly, lest one of the vanguard hear us. What's going on here? Tanvo Inderil and his vanguard stopped here on the way to the tormented spire. At first, the Grandmaster refused Tarnvil access to the mountain. Then Tarnvil snapped. He ordered his vanguard to take the Grandmaster's son hostage. That doesn't sound like Tarnvil and Doral. Tarnvil has lost control. He must be stopped, but first, the Grandmaster needs help. Nadra Slaw upstairs will know more. Go, and good luck. Thank you, Seneschal. <laughs> Her name is very weird. Um, I just want to see what you have. Brass wedding pin. Mm, that will be stolen later. I don't know if I want to go upstairs. I heard sounds that I that seem like I shouldn't be interrupting. Oh, that doesn't look pleasant. <laughs> what is happening? Why is she bald? What's happening here? Speak with care as you talk to Helgana. Her injuries are too great. Her soul will soon be with her honored ancestors in Sovngarde. I am just here to see her on her way. You're sexy. Goodbye. Please, come, come closer. <laughs> you need to know the Covenant portal. The Covenant have let, set up a portal where? Soft low, soft low cavern. Northeast of town. Please, have to stop them. Can't let them. Can't let them set up a base. Is there anything I can do for you? Pray for me. I can hear the skulls singing the songs of Sovngarde. My ancestors. I can almost see their faces. That is a very sad fate for this woman. What you have to steal. You won't need it in the afterlife. You didn't see that. <laughs> Honor to you and your house. Uh, what can I do for you? Since Charles Ferren sent me, do you ha know where this Grandmaster's son is being held? No. You'll need to take the information from the Vanguard. As I see it, you have two options. You could sneak into their barracks here in town, or you could assault their camp. How can I get inside the barracks? You'll need a disguise to appear as one of the Vanguard. Oh, the great. sentry at the door is turning everyone else away. Once inside, try to stay out of sight. Speak to Kasha. I hear she might have what you're looking for. What can you tell me about this camp? The Vanguard camp? set up camp east of town. When Tarnvul went to the Spire, he took most of his troops with him. Those left behind won't like someone just wandering in. They're spoiling for a fight. All right. I think I know what to do. Excellent. What have you decided? I'm going to sneak in. Kasha's just outside, selling her wares near the manor wall. Once you've found what we're looking for, get back here and report to Daedu. She'll know what to do. May I... no, you know what, bye. Kayla, want to check the soup, please? Yeah. Make sure it's not burning. 
These things are great to sell for cash. <laughs> Smooth like butter. Smooth like vodka. Smooth like vodka. <laughs> What is this? Cultists. Is there a good amount of liquid? Yeah, but it's, it's shot in a little bit. Hello. Concentrated with the stuff, but there's still a good amount of liquid. Hello, keep moving. Keep moving. Oh, this one's empty. <laughs> All right, so it seems that I am good to go. Lovely little town, lovely. Fresh, that line. <laughs> what? Those archways. I know, aren't those beautiful? They're like pointed, but with like those like Asian style roofs. I like them. Into the fungal grotto. Grotto. <laughs> oh, grotto. 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 Greetings. Hello. I'm not going into the fungal grotto just yet. I actually need to get things. I need to do things. I need to talk to someone. This woman. You come to buy from this one, yes? <laughs> Grandmaster gives a special license to sell and trade. Many fine wares. I had a rumor you might have a vanguard uniform for sale. Perhaps. Can't remember. Kasha is a loyal servant and doesn't wish harm to come to House Dress. With some... Maybe I can intimidate her. Threats and menace, threats and menace. Here, take the uniform and leave poor Kasha to her bondage. <laughs> That's right. Good kitty. <laughs> Stay moist. All right, I do as I do, please. <laughs> Greetings. Greetings. That's the shopping area. There's a tower or something down there. I think I'm going to peace out just for a little bit so I can go eat some dinner. And then, um... Back yeah. I'm gonna go watch an episode of Lost Girl, eat some dinner, and then I'll be back in. I'll sign back in. So anyway, guys, thank you for watching me, and I hope you've enjoyed, um, my... Whatever. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. It's been fun. But I'll be back. And, uh, I'll be uploading all of these to my YouTube at youtube.com slash gingerand. And thanks for joining me. All right, bye, guys.